All right, let's talk about the Big Bang, the very beginning of the universe as we know it. Around 13.8 billion years ago, everything, all the matter, energy, space, and even time itself, was packed into this unbelievably tiny, super hot, and super dense point. Scientists call this a singularity. Then suddenly, it started expanding really fast. That's what we call the Big Bang. And here's the crazy part. That expansion is still happening today. The universe is getting bigger every single second. Now before the Big Bang, there wasn't really a before. Time and space literally started with that event. Asking what happened before is kind of like asking, what's north of the North Pole? The question doesn't really work, but scientists do have some theories. Some think the universe went through cycles, expanding, collapsing, and then expanding again. Others suggest our universe might be just one bubble in a larger multiverse. And then there's the idea of quantum fluctuations, where the universe just sort of popped into existence from the quantum vacuum. We also know the Big Bang wasn't like a bomb exploding in empty space. Instead, space itself was stretching, carrying everything with it. In the first tiny fraction of a second, less than a trillionth of a second, the universe went through something called cosmic inflation, expanding faster than the speed of light. That's what set up the structure for galaxies, stars, and planets to form later. And today we have solid evidence for the Big Bang, cosmic microwave background radiation, a faint afterglow of the Big Bang that's still detectable everywhere in space. Redshift of galaxies, meaning galaxies are moving away from us, proving the universe is still expanding, and the abundance of light elements like hydrogen and helium, which formed in the first few minutes after the Big Bang. So, the Big Bang wasn't just the start of the universe, it was the start of space, time, matter, and energy. From that one tiny point, the universe has grown into everything we see today, stars, planets, galaxies, and even us.